Hi there, my name is John. Uh, I'm the head chef at Senor Buddha's. Today we're going to fillet a fish called a uh, place and also going to serve it with the seaweed butter. Okay, so, so here's the place. Uh, I got my sharp knife ready to go. Um, and we're going to start at the top near his head. And we're going to work our way down. There's a bone in the middle. So if I start at the top and slice it down like this. And then I'm going to turn the fish 90 degree angle just to slide, there's a bone, like a big bone that goes to it and you want to follow that down, nice smooth strokes and it should come away nice and cleanly. So I've just tidied up the fillet now, taking out the, this bit, there's a rope from some sort of female fish um, just to make it look neat in the pan. And you'll notice that there's two that are slightly bigger. The top one, they, uh, they're a bigger fillet in general on the fish, uh, and the two little ones are from the bottom of the fish. So we've got all our ingredients here for our seaweed butter. We have a nori seaweed, which you find in this, uh, sort of wrapping like sushi and stuff like that, a fresh Dutch chili, a knob of ginger, a couple of cloves of garlic, and a packet of unsalted batter. And as everything is going into a food blender, it doesn't need to be too chopped up. Diced butter, your garlic, chili and ginger. Okay, so the nori seaweed comes in sheets, as you can see. Uh, and we're just going to rip it up, literally. And okay, it's looking about right. Just make sure that there's no big chunks in there. There we have uh, the seaweed butter. Let's go over to the kitchen. Skin side down. We want to cook the bottom bit first and get most of the heat coming through the skin rather than the top because otherwise it gets a bit too crispy and it's a very thin fillet anyway. And it's on a medium heat, so or medium to low heat. Just pushing down just to make sure that the skin is properly cooked on the bottom because it has a tendency to curl up. Okay, I'm ready to put my butter in now. As you can see, it's still cooked. It's not cooked on the top, but the butter's going to melt down. Face the butter. I'm going to turn the heat off because I don't want it to burn. The residual heat will carry on cooking it. Here we are, ready to plate up. Uh, I've just got a little bit of a garnish. So there's a, it's just some fresh, orient, normal, orient, uh, normal coriander, and uh, a little bit of watercress just to brighten the plate up a little bit. Uh, and a little bit of de-seeded fresh chili as well. We'll start with the big one. In there, and then the little one on top. Okay. okay, and then we've still got a little bit of butter left over in the pan. Uh, and a little bit of fresh chili for color. Uh, and these are just little micro herbs. Uh, it's a red amaris is what I'm using at the moment. Okay, and there we have it, place with seaweed butter with Asian flavours.